Millions of people the world over suffer from skin ailments such as neurodermatitis, vitiligo, the white patch disease, or psoriasis. Often they will simply come to terms with the disease, giving up all hope of recovery. But their symptoms make them suffer. They often feel ostracized by society. Redness and scaling on elbows and knees are among the typical symptoms of psoriasis. Afflicted people frequently hide the affected parts of the body. But no one has to put up with this disease anymore. Today, these abnormal skin conditions and symptoms can be treated. Modern phototherapy offers psoriasis sufferers an effective method of treatment. The effectiveness of modern phototherapy is backed up by scientific proof. Research and studies have shown that some segments of natural sunlight have a positive effect on inflammatory processes in the skin. Lamps in modern phototherapy devices can generate precisely these therapeutic light wavelengths. Today, many dermatologists offer phototherapy in the treatment of psoriasis and other skin conditions. Before starting therapy, the sufferer should discuss the details with their dermatologist. Prior to starting the therapy, the dermatologist must determine the optimum initial dose. This depends on the patient's skin type and clinical condition. The dermatologist also informs the patient about the possible risks and side effects. To ensure that the therapy is correctly targeted, the severity and symptoms of the psoriasis are examined and precisely noted. Light therapy is generally well tolerated and should be applied three to five times a week. Phototherapy uses specific UV light rays that are highly effective. The spectrum of natural UV radiation is divided into UVA, UVB and UVC rays, depending on wavelength. Only long-wave UVA rays and short-wave UVB rays are used for therapeutic purposes. UVA rays have a wavelength of 315 to 380 nanometers and penetrate to the dermis or lower skin layer. Here they impact inflammatory cells and specific connective tissue cells. UVB rays have a wavelength of 280 to 315 nanometers and impact the epidermis or outer skin layer. The long wave segment of UVB light also has a special effect on the lower layers of the epidermis, especially the basal layer. There is a slight danger of erythema in the application of long wave parts of the UVA spectrum, as opposed to the application of a UVA-UVB combined spectrum. That is why phototherapy using the selective long-wave UVB spectrum, known as narrow-band UVB therapy, has proved invaluable in the treatment of psoriasis. The maximum peak of UVB rays emitted is 311 nanometers. The effectiveness is due on the one hand to its immune modulating effect, in which inflammatory cells, for example T lymphocytes and special mediators such as interleukins, are affected. On the other hand, as a result of the optimally suited wavelengths, excessive rapid cell division in the basal layer of the epidermis is inhibited. This complex effect mechanism leads to a clinically measurable improvement in the inflammatory alterations of the skin and a reduction in scaling. As it is highly effective and well tolerated, narrowband UVB therapy is today regarded as the therapy of choice for moderately severe and severe cases of psoriasis. Both full-body machines and machines that target specific parts of the body are used in phototherapy treatment. Full-body therapy units are radiation booths equipped with special medical UV lamps that deliver all over even radiation of the body. In contrast to solariums where tanning is the only aim, scientifically advanced and medically approved light therapy machines are extremely safe for patients. Professional sensor technology combined with modern control systems ensure effective and safe phototherapy treatment. During every radiation session, the patient's eyes must be protected by special UV protection glasses. Dosage is set directly in the control system by trained medical staff or can also be transmitted online via the EDP system. The preset dosage is delivered exactly. Fixed dosage limits and plausibility checks integrated into the control system are an added safety factor. 
At the end of the radiation session, or should the session be interrupted, the UV lamps switch off automatically. To treat individual limbs or parts of the body, the inner surface of the affected hand or foot is placed directly on the therapy module. Here too, the lamps switch off automatically once the preset dosage has been delivered. Psoriasis sufferers experience noticeable relief. Their daily lives are easier and they're more relaxed with family and friends. Their skin changes as it heals. Are you also affected? then phototherapy is something you should definitely consider too.